Welcome back, oh my peeps, to another Let's Play Risen to Dark Waters. I am Zexor, your host for this part 143 of the series. We've just finished talking to Valdez and letting him know what happened to, uh, to, Corriente, to Corrientes and his group, and Garcia, uh, that he's taken over and that they defiled him and took their clothes and all that. So now, we're going to continue on up in here and do a few conversations. And we will see what we hear. It's just that uh, I've had enough of this place. I've had better postings, I'll give you that. Better? This place is the pits. I know what you mean. The jungle. Pirates, the beasts, the natives. Commandant Corrientes will get us out of here. Wait and see. Um, I hate to break the bad news to you guys, but it's just that. Alright, okay, it looks like it enough repeats. of this place. It's kind of weird that there's like the big pause between things, but okay, whatever. I've had better postings. I'll give you that. Alright, let's uh, let's save it. I think. See if we can rip their storage off a little bit in here. See what we can manage to do. Whoops. There we go. Steal, steal. I don't know how much we will or will not be able to get away with in here, but we'll try. See if we can steal as much as possible. If there's anything behind there that we could try to get. Possibly, I suppose. Whoops, no, nope, I don't want to be rolling. See, that draws his attention. Dang it. Let's run out. Alright. Did not mean to roll. Nope. Back up. I sneak here. All right, now let's see. Hey, it looks like he should be going the other way, right? Because he's already facing that way and should walk that way. I would think, but let's see what happens. Yeah. They're having him stroll on over there. I can get behind this pillar, maybe he won't see me. Yeah, it doesn't look like he sees me so far. Save again. <sighs> Once again, I'm saving way too much in this game, but whatever. Basically, come on, dude. Where are you going? You keep going this way. You're going to go the other way. Turn around. Turn your back. You don't need to face this way anymore. It's okay. You can turn around. It's fine. All right. He keeps walking. So that's my mark to do this. I think. Does he see me still? Does he see me yet, or is he still... Nah, he's still not really paying attention. Safe. Turn around. And uh, we'll see if he notices me. Fifteen gold, sword blanks, grog, and an officer's ring. Yeah, he did not notice. Very good. Okay. I could probably kife this also. But, uh, 
Uh, but I'm gonna have to go around the other side to do it. That's all right. Come over here. A little bit closer. No, 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 we don't want to get in trouble, <laughs> all right, well, let me just, I'll try that later, for now, let's see if I can keep sneaking over this way. You notice me? No, doesn't look like it. Ah, uh, is this gonna be too close? No, it doesn't look like it. Patty, uh, you really don't get in my game there, Patty. Friend, let me save again. See if no, 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 no. He notices. All right, reload. <clears throat> I gotta figure out a way to get up there without. say Okay, you're just gonna notice, whatever. Guess there's probably not a way to. Probably not a way to do it, really. Not well, anyway. We have my last attempt. Maybe. Last attempt. This will fail, probably, and then I'll be done. But let's. One last attempt. Yep, that failed. Okay, okay, that's fine. We'll just go. Ahead, we'll just talk to him. I'll. I won't worry about that. <laughs> I don't need to kife every little thing. Oh, I tried. Okay, enough time wasted. Sorry about that, guys. Spent a while trying to sneak around and steal. Okay, so let's just go talk to him now. Hey, buddy. What? How did you get in here? <laughs> okay, so uh, let's see what this is like. I'm a messenger from the demon Mara. Shut up. That's not remotely funny. As you can see, things haven't gone as planned. <laughs> Our provisions are at the bottom of the sea or scattered along the beach. Anyone or anything could attack us at any time. And I'm the one trying to sort out what we've got left. Expedition work not quite as you pictured. Tell me about it. A journey to a lush and distant land, they said. A land untouched by the dark wave. It sounded like it would be a grand adventure. Travel and excitement, exotic food, dusky foreign maidens. And now, here I am, nose deep in the shit. Have you anything to trade? We don't have much left. Maybe, if you do me a favor. Like what? There's some undamaged storage barrels down the beach. 
If I could get six more of them, I'd have enough items to trade with you. We can do business without the barrels too, right? I suppose so. I still have some things I could trade. But it'd be much more useful to have what's inside those barrels. I'll get you your barrels. That'd be a great help. Okay, and if you remember, those barrels were what we picked up when we left the ship first arriving at Marakai Bay. On the left, there was the beach, and Chani was like, we should gather everything we can find. Yeah, those barrels that we found, that's what he's talking about, so. And here are your six barrels. Oh, good work. Now we've got enough provisions to make a start of surviving here. That's got to be worth a reward, I think. Okay, sweet. So now... What do you have to trade? Okay, so uh, before I started recording, just to make this faster, because I know you guys love seeing me go through all my equipment, <laughs> I've just decided, I've already decided what I'm going to buy and what I'm going to sell. So, let me just go through this list here. So, we'll sell the Buccaneer's Knife. We're going to sell the Dueling Epe, and you'll see why in a minute. We are going to sell uh, the old, uh, where is it? Yeah, we're going to sell the old coat, and you'll see why in a minute. Okay. We're going to sell the soul necklace, because even though it gives us bonus to death cold, black magic, and ritual, we get those from other things. We get Tihako gives us death cold and black magic, better black magic, and death cold at the same time. And warrior's jewelry gives us ritual that's better than this. So we'll sell this. The tribal symbol, symbol is only five rituals, so we sell that. This still gives us bulletproof, so we'll still keep that. Um, okay, so then uh, we're going to sell the thief's ring because dirty tricks I can get through ring of deception much better, 15. And uh, the blade ring gives us 20 thievery, so I'm just going to sell the thief's ring. And the skull ring slashing weapons and intimidate. But uh, I don't know if I have intimidate on something else. That's the only thing. We have two officers' rings, so we'll sell one of them. Um, so I'll keep this for intimidate factor in case I decide I need it. I'm not really using it generally, but just in case. Okay, um, we're going to sell the skins of the animals we found. So sell, 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 and sell, sell. Okay, sell three claws. So we're down to eight because we use them in some potions. I Grave spiders are, I mean, they're not amazingly tough now. We kind of discovered how to defeat them, but they're not a whole ton of them, and I don't really know that they respawn. So we'll keep all the eyes. Um, feathers will sell four. So we're down to ten because I know how to get those pretty easily. Pearl will sell. Ruby, Ruby will sell. Sell gold down to gold nuggets down to four. So we have we'll sell six. Sell, 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 sell. Okay, that's everything we're selling. Uh, I believe. Okay, so now we're going to buy. The rapier is better than the, the dueling epe we had. The only difference is we lose five bonus to piercing weapons, but it's much better damage on the low end, high end. So we buy that. We buy a heavy leather coat because that's eight better on bullet and blade proof from what we had before. We're going to buy studded trousers because those are uh, one better than what we've got. You don't have the silver tongue, but just general, it's better, so that's good. And then finally, uh, we're going to buy red wine, which he doesn't really sell to us. We just get it from him, I think. We could turn that into Sophia for the quest over on uh, the Sword Coast. And finally, our cannonball, which is a legendary item. So we're going to sell, do that so we can complete that quest. That's expensive, but we complete it. So we're down to almost no, no money again, but we're much better outfitted than we were. So that will do it. <laughs> Hi, I'm all nudie again. <laughs> uh, so we'll, do, we'll leave that. So let's see. I'll do the rep, rapier, and we'll do the heavy leather coat, and we're going to do the studded trousers. And I believe... So the earring, we're going to go back to um, this to give me bonus on that. And this already gives me a bonus. 
So I think we're set up now. So we'll go ahead and end that there. This has been part 143 of Let's Play Risen 2 Dark Waters. I'm Zexor, your host. In the next part, we'll hopefully now finally go confront Garcia. So until next time, peace.